Hey everyone, this is Nick Orlando with Core AI. And in this video, we're going to be talking about testing virtual assistants. So testing is a critical step in the virtual assistant life cycle, right? Uh, before you launch your virtual assistant to production, before folks are actually using it, you want to make sure that it works, right? It's pretty simple, um, but testing is so, so important. And there are a variety of ways in which you can go about your testing. Uh, because ultimately, when you do get to production, you want to be delivering an experience that people love and people really enjoy using. So let's jump right into it. There's a couple different things uh, that I want to talk about when it comes to testing. So first off, let's talk about utterance testing. What utterance testing is, is basically just if you have an utterance, if you have a query, one question, submit it to the virtual assistant, does it understand? Does it identify the correct intent? Is it capturing the correct entities? Does it do what you want for that single utterance, that one single utterance? That's kind of the, that's bare bones minimum. That's step one. Then we have step two, right? Step two is batch testing. This is when you collect a significant amount of these test cases. Uh, machine learning models are typically trained on you know, hundreds to thousands of different utterances. So over time, what you want to do is you want to build out your, uh, your testing suite so that you can perform batch tests where you have you know, tens or hundreds or thousands of different ways that somebody could ask a question to the virtual assistant that you're testing the virtual assistant on to understand if there is any, uh, if there are any gaps in understanding. Once you've identified the gaps, then you can go through and make sure that that training data is added to retrain your virtual assistant so that it's getting smarter over time. We'll talk more about that in another video though. For here, I wanna talk about testing, right? So we have our utterance testing, we have our batch testing. And then the next is conversation testing. So this is essentially, you know, you're going to pick a channel that you're going to interact with the virtual assistant on. Could be a chat, could be a voice channel, uh, could be a mobile app, could be a, a home, a home speaker experience, whatever channel it is. And this just looks like an entire conversational flow that you're going to have with that virtual assistant. So conversation testing is more so around the entire conversational experience. How does it look? How does it feel as you're interacting with this virtual assistant? Is it a good experience or does it need improvement? Okay. And then finally, one of the best ways to test your virtual assistant is through pilot programs, right? So what a pilot would be is you launch your virtual assistant, you give access to it to 50 people. 100 people, maybe it's friends and family, maybe it's all people that you know or work with, um, could just be internally at your company. It can be any, any type of way that you want to go about the pilot. Uh, you select a, a small number of users and you give them access to it and you let them run with it. Then what you're going to be doing is you're going to be gathering a bunch of data so that you can understand where it's working well, where it's not working well, what does this overall experience look like? You can then take this data and use it to improve your virtual assistant over time. So those are the ways that we think about um, you know, testing your virtual assistant and making sure that it's delivering on that phenomenal experience once you get to production. Thanks so much for your time, and I look forward to talking to you again soon.